Check out these chaps, apron style chainsaw chaps. Put them on in front of your legs. It helps prevent injury from a chainsaw. Have a, some government OSHA certifications. Boot to crotch chainsaw protective cover. Five layer protective material. High vis. Left front wedge pocket. Adjustable two inch waist belt fits up to 48 inch waist. Adjustable leg straps on the back, I'll show you. Water and oil resistant. Greensboro, North Carolina. Instructions. Well, how am I going to test that these work? I'm definitely not going to put a chainsaw on them when they're on my leg. Or will I? Warm machine wash. Rinse early. Do not bleach. Line dry only. Do not tumble dry. Small cuts can be repaired by hand stitching through the outer covering only. If it's gone all the way through, the garment must be destroyed or rendered unusable. Lifetime refers to manufacturing defects. Okay. So first things first on these chaps. Really high vis, nice quality. They only fit on the front of the legs. And you know what chaps are. You people ride these, put these on when they're riding horses. There's pocket here in the front, Velcro. Let me show you something to be careful of when you're ordering these is the size is 36 out seam i originally ordered a smaller one thinking inseam the inside of your legs are measured shorter than the outside of your legs so if you're like a 32 33 inseam you need to order a 36 out seam this is a large size so again measure on the outside of your leg not normally the inside this is normally when you buy pants they're measured on this side but these you measure here so if you bought 32 here they'd be really short if you had a 32 inseam Pretty thick. I wonder what they're made out of, but some kind of multi material, multi layered. Comfortable, they just hang there. And they don't cover the feet. Presumably, if you're that concerned, you wear steel toe boots or something. But you get a chainsaw, it's either going to go up or it's going to go down. back you're doing something with the wood up just using it you're just trying to protect but I'm not going to turn it on like that just in case it doesn't work so I've got it right between the fence I'm gonna hit chainsaw right here I'm not worried about damaging them I damage them it doesn't go through then I know it would protect me but just to show you I'm also going to first cut a piece of this wood see what kind of destructive power the chainsaw has as you can see I have two pair 
So let's test it. <laughs> See what happened here. Got a couple cuts in it, and it only went through the outside. Did not go through this little area. That one poked out a little bit. I guess the good thing is it's not. It didn't go through in the first two cuts, which means it would save my leg. I hit it pretty hard. I don't like damaging things like that just for testing but I'm glad it's on here and not on my leg that would have went right through my jeans and cut my skin it's kind of white fabric and as they say that can be sewn up I'll probably just put an iron on a patch here okay so they're keepers for me I'm gonna wear them anytime I chainsaw safety first always any kind of protection is better than no protection. Gloves, helmet, goggles, a backup, always work with a buddy. And now I've got these here. Notch, chainsaw chaps.